Hello, everyone. This is Julie. みなさんこんばんは。ジュリです。本日はグリム童話でリスニングのスキルアップを目指しましょう。1回目はそのまま聞いてみて、2回目は YouTube の字幕機能を使って答え合わせをしてみましょう。本日のお話はラプンツェルです。ぜひ最後までお付き合いください。At first, Rapunzel was terribly frightened when a man, such as her eyes had never yet beheld, came to her. But the king's son began to talk to her quite like a friend, and told her that his heart had been so stirred that it had let him have no rest, and he had been forced to see her. Then Rapunzel lost her fear, and when he asked her if she would take him for her husband, and she saw that he was young and handsome, she thought, He will love me more than old Dame Gothel does. And she said yes, and laid her hand in his. She said, I will willingly go away with you, but I do not know how to get down. Bring with you a skin of silk every time that you come, and I will weave a ladder with it. And when that is ready, I will descend, and you will take me on your horse. They agreed that until that time he should come to her every evening, for the old woman came by day. The enchantress remarked nothing of this, until once Rapunzel said to her, Tell me, Dame Gothel, how it happens that you are so much heavier for me to draw up than the young king's son. He is with me in the moment. Ah, you wicked child, cried the enchantress. What do I hear you say? I thought I had separated you from all the world, and yet you have deceived me. In her anger, she clutched Rapunzel's beautiful tresses. Wrapped them twice around her left hand, seized a pair of scissors with the right, and snip snap, they were cut off, and the lovely braids lay on the ground. And she was so pitiless that she took poor Rapunzel into a desert where she had to live in great grief and misery. How was it? お楽しみいただけましたかそれではまた次回。ジュリでした。See you next time!